Hi, I'm Colleen from the Lanyard Ladies, and now we're going to learn how to make a V friendship bracelet. I have five colors, and I have 30 inches here, and you need to find the center of the 30 inches. At the center, we make a knot. So after we have a knot in our string, we take our cardboard, we're going to put a slit at the top, and we're going to need several slits at the bottom, because we have to separate the strings across the bottom, all the individual colors. So we put the knot in the top, and we tape it around the back. And now we separate our strings. The key to this bracelet is the setup of the color pattern. So, because you have two of each color, you want to put one color on this side, on the left, and you're going to put the same exact color directly on the other side. So now we're going to put yellow next to the purple. Now we're ready to get started. We can put the cardboard into the clipboard and we begin. This bracelet comes down and meets in the middle. So from the left, when we use the strings, we do the forward knot to the middle in that direction, from left to right. Then when we come in from the right side, we're doing the backward knot and we go from right to left. So this bracelet uses both the forward knot and the backward knot. We're going to start on the left with our forward knot. Tuck it underneath into the loop and you pull it up. Two forward knots on each different color string. and attach into your cardboard. Now you take the purple from the opposite side and you do the backwards D to meet in the middle with the other purple. Now you take these two purple strings and you'll notice that the bracelet at the very top there is now separated. So you need to connect the bracelet with these two strings. You're going to do the forward knot, the number four, to tie them up together. Two knots in the middle. That's one, and that's two. And you'll tuck them back in. And now we go back outside, and we do the same thing with the leftmost string, making the number four underneath and you pull it up. Put two on the blue. Two on the royal. Now two on the purple. Okay, now you'll notice that I don't have a slot in the bottom of the board for the yellow, so I have to take these strings and just move them over to the left to make room. And I'll put this here. And now we do the Ds from the right side with the other yellow. You'll notice if you don't hold this string that you're working on tight enough that you won't get a yellow knot at the top. You'll get the blue knot at the top. So you make sure as you're making your Ds or your fours that you're holding the bottom string tight as you pull the knot up. Okay, that's one, that's two. And now we're gonna tie up our yellows. Again, using the number four. 
one. That's two. Now we'll tuck these in at the bottom. And now you can see at the top how our V pattern is starting to come into play right there. So if you continue working on your, on your V bracelet, you'll make it long enough to fit your wrist. This is what the bracelet looks like when it's completed. In this case, I made two braids at the bottom and I tie it into the loop at this end so I can take it on and off. I don't have to keep wearing it. And this is how you make the V friendship bracelet.